What's up, it's your boy Steven Joe, aka Mr. Kaka. Yeah, ma'am, thank you, ma'am. I am so glad I ain't a girl. You know why? Having sex with everybody ain't cool if you're a girl. But for us guys, it's like an Xbox Live achievement, okay? We go on and brag about it, we, well, who we did and what, who we done. Do you understand this life is a video game for us? This is Call of Duty, my nigga. Us guys, we don't have to worry about um, anybody calling us a hoe, a slut, uh, a cunt bag, or a uh, empty bag of Doritos, like, come on, we don't care. It's, I'm telling you, we don't have to worry about that. At the end of the day, I ain't no dog. Listen, I'm a coyote. <laughs> Y'all girls get periods, oh, and Lord Jesus, this emotional stage of the month, periods? It's like Adolf Hitler trying to stick a dildo in your mouth. He's trying to anally rape you, kid. I don't like that, dog. Girls be going through some I would never want to have no period. That thing is sad. That's why I respect y'all, because y'all go through a lot. And I be thinking to myself, what if, what if us guys had periods? Like, it would be called, what would it be called? I think it would be called commas. Commas. Because, you know, comma and period. We'll get to that later. Y'all girls take so long just to do y'all hair. It takes like six hours just to do your, a goddamn piggy tail or pig nail or whatever y'all call y'all hair dudes or Bobby or Bob Chappelle or whatever. By the time y'all done straightening y'all hair, Obama presidency gonna be goddamn over already. I take so long. I don't even have patience to sit down in the barber chair getting a haircut and it's only 15 to 20 minutes. I don't have patience for that. My ass be hurting. I'll be ready to hop out that chair. And by the way, the next barber that sprayed all that alcohol, too much alcohol on my head after a haircut, I'm coming for your ass, boy. I ain't playing. That thing be burning. Every feeling like Anne Frank trying to, um, I don't like that. Mr. Kaka don't like that. Rest in peace, Anne Frank. You my nigga. I can't be no girl. At least a pretty one, because there's too many horny motherfuckers around. Just imagine how many dudes haul out a one pretty girl a day just in the streets or in the club or something. This, this, that, it gets so annoying. You got the ugly ones, you got the, the ones that look like me, a coyote with no self-control. And you have the pretty boys. There's so much coming after you. You got the pedophiles and the, the, the cougars and the one that's trying to rape you and all that. I'm telling you, you can, a pretty girl can't even walk in the alley at 10 o'clock at night because you, it's going to be a big percentage that your ass might get raped, molested, or eaten by goddamn dinosaurs. Somebody going to take your ass. Some, somebody. Girls get cheated on and lied on too much, man. And those guys take advantage of y'all, man. I mean, me, I told you I'm a coyote. I respect girls, okay? And I'm a faithful motherfucker. I'm as faithful as Bobby Brown is, as faithful as to his crack. I'm as faithful as DMX is, as faithful as living in prison and going to jail every week, okay? I'm faithful about mine, okay? So get a correct bobo with a little ho 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 ho. You feel me? And that's what it is. This is boy Steven Joe, aka Mr. Kaka. Yam yam, thank you, ma'am. If you want to fuck me like Uncle Sam, you have to give me 10 grand and maybe eat my pussy like Sam for my Carly, but goddamn, this is your boy Steven Joe. If you want more blogs, just um leave comments below and tell me your ideas on topics that should be the next vlog. You feel me? I'm coming for your mama, maybe Obama, but I will blow you up like Osama Bin Laden. No, I will not because my pussy will never be caught in the web. Maybe I taste it because it's wet. <laughs>